That's pretty much. Okay. So tell me about your game. Uh, well, we made Pong. We yes. made it. It's our <laughs> own style of Pong. Excellent. Could you demo it? Yeah, for sure. Uh, we have uh, a couple of five different buttons. This is player one, up and down. This is player two, up and down. And then here we have our uh, start and pause button. Excellent. So to start the game. You have two controllers here. Yes. What do they do? Uh, well, only one's in use. Yeah, okay. The other one's left yeah, over from last just, summer. That's cool. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. And start the game. Ball gets pitched. Oh, nice. Sound <laughs> Oh. Well, let's see some action here, man. You played Pong before, right? I, I, I never practiced. There we go. You're supposed to practice before your demo. <laughs> Gotta make it look good. There you go. Alright. <laughs> what do you play to? Play to three? Oh, uh, actually, it plays up to nine. Okay. I don't know if he has one. Yeah, we'd probably just let it go. Then. Yeah. Sure. We don't, is, it, is there something special happen at nine? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, See it. Right well, we have scores on the top, uh, which Sean handled. Yeah, every time the ball crosses a certain axis. How does it choose which direction it goes? Uh, uh, whoever, yeah, whoever made the point, it gets served towards them. It's so like Depending right now, player two game. won. So yeah. We'll go back to player two. I'm with you. Vice versa. That's why it keeps changing. Uh, and then see player one won. One. The game is over. Excellent. And just hit the start button two times to start yeah. it again. Resets hitting it. it once clears it, and then hitting it again starts the game. Very nice.